Hello everyone, my name is Cody Harrison. I'm an application engineer here at Yokogawa. Today I'm going to show you how to hook up your current leads on the WT5000. They have the new 6mm safety leads. The WT5000 is available with two different input modules. The 7609013 amp high accuracy element and the 7609025 5 amp high accuracy element. Both elements include the connectors for making the voltage and current connections necessary for power measurement. The 7609025 amp elements use 4 mm safety banana jacks for current measurement. However, the 7609013 amp elements use a new female 6 mm plug for current measurements. This 6 mm plug has an internal locking mechanism that has been introduced as a safety improvement for the previous binding post design, while also ensuring a properly sized conductor can be used for high current 30 amp loads. In this video, I will demonstrate how to set up and use the new 6 mm connectors with the A1650JZ adapters that come with every 760901 element. Here I have one A1650JZ current safety terminal adapter set. It comes with a cap, a cover, and a plug, along with a screw and a set of washers for attaching the wire to the plug. You will also need a lug or spade terminal for attaching the wires to the plugs. Once the cable is attached to your plug securely using the spade connector and the screw, you can then put the adapter together. One more thing I would like to point out before we connect to our WT5000 is the post on the end of the plug. These posts are stopping points for the connector and only allow you to disconnect the plug if it is turned to the correct angle. When installing your cables to the current connections on your 760901 element, you will hold the connector with both posts pointing vertically. Then gently push in on the connector until you hear it click. Gently pull back on the cable to make sure that it is locked in. To disconnect the cable, turn the connector until the post is pointed towards the corner such that the connector can now be pushed in. Gently push the connector inward towards the instrument to release the locking mechanism. You can now gently pull back on the connector, removing it from the instrument. If you have difficulty removing the connector, do not tug, yank, or use heavy force in an attempt to remove it. In all likelihood, one of the three steps have been missed, so simply repeat the process. I hope that you found this video helpful in connecting your current measurement leads to your WT5000 Precision Power Analyzer. For more information, or if you have any questions, please visit tmi.yokogawa.com. Also, don't forget to click subscribe to join our YouTube channel. Thank you for watching.